Two people are facing felony charges tonight after a shipment of marijuana arrived from the West Coast. Johnson County Sheriff's deputies made the arrest after an investigator noticed a suspicious package at a local FedEx center. CBS 17 investigator Richard Essex takes a look at the law and arrest. According to the Johnson County Sheriff's Office, Joshua Ferguson took delivery of 23 pounds of pot at this home in Willow Spring. When I knocked on the door, the person on their side didn't open the door and told us to politely leave. According to court records, Ferguson and a female friend, Anisha Gibbs, are charged with trafficking marijuana. Ferguson faces additional charges for maintaining a dwelling for controlled substances. Deputies found 20 bags of weed in a cardboard box right next to the TV in the front room of the house. North Carolina marijuana laws for personal possession have been relaxed in the past couple years and medical marijuana legislation is gaining traction in the state house. What we're going to be proposing is adult use local option medical um, legalization. Representative Kelly Alexander says his legislation would set up a regulated supply chain, provide a certification process for those seeking treatment, and allow local cities and towns to opt in or out of the law, similar to how liquor sales worked in our state. Alexander says support for medical marijuana is growing, but still has some hurdles. They start thinking about uh, uh, hellfire, damnation, sin, and, you know, all of that. Um, the reality is that there is some good science is being developed that shows that marijuana medically uh, has some kind of efficacy with about 30 some odd different conditions. Currently there is no proposed legislation for adult recreational marijuana in North Carolina. In Raleigh, Richard Essex, CBS 17 News.